How's it going, everybody? It is your boy, the one and only Chaos Gamer, and we are back with more My Hero Academia Ultra Impact. And today, guys, we're going to be going over the brand new event that has come out with the Nejiri, Nejiri Hado and the Uraraka. This event is where you can grind the brand new free to play support memory that has come out. This support memory is very good, so I suggest that if you are asking, you should grind this event. You definitely should grind this event, especially if you have the brand new unit, because she is a boost in this brand new event. So, with that being said, let's not waste any more time. Let's blow this shit right up and let's get started with the video. So, if you guys can see right here on the top right corner, we are going to be clicking on this event, and this is where we are going to start our adventure of grinding. Now, yes, as you may notice, I am on my Japanese account. The reason why I'm on my Japanese account is so I can show you guys the whole event format because it's more easier that way. My account is way more stronger here than on my global account. Once my global account is more stronger, I'll show it on that side more often. But it's everything's literally the same, guys. The only difference is the language. So you can reference with your Ultra Impact with what I'm looking at right now. So don't worry, it's not that big of a deal that the language is different. Now, another way to get into this event as well, as you can see with the Deku and Uraraka, the, both of them that are clutching their fists right here, you can see that it's a little bit darker than the rest of the icons. You click right here and bam, you're also able to hit this event as well. Now, one of these things that I do want to say is that, damn, this music is so fun. <laughs> can we just take a moment just listen to the music? Hold on. God, this music is so good. But this event is where you're only able to grind the support memory. You do not grind a character in this event. As you can see in the shop right here, the brand new support memory is right here. The support memory, again, is very good. It is able to boost HP by... Um, this is level 1, so it's not maxed out yet. I don't know what's the maxed percentage. So it's able to boost your HP, but also you're able to boost your damage as well. I don't remember specifically how. Um, yeah, I don't remember who it's for or how it's done, but it's able to boost your damage more So definitely a support member you want to grind for you are also able to get fragments or no They don't call it fragments. But I had to call it by the correct term now They also have pieces here the SR Endeavor piece that you are able to get on banners The SR Kaminari piece that you are able to get through the USJ mode and some R pieces Which you know, you don't care about tickets that you can summon on any banner with that are singles only So you definitely want to grind that up as well the advancement slots that I will be going over in another video this makes your character even stronger once you have boosted them out um the equipment advancements do they call it advancement slots i don't remember but this is for your equipment i'll be going over these two things in another video once i get my chapters more up in the quest so i can unlock both and i will show them both at the same time we also have candy bars that you're able to make your characters even stronger to level up the memory slots xp item that you're able to make your memories even stronger you are also able to grind out um these items that are able to make your character stronger through the ability board. As you can see right here, there is different types of colors for each kind. And they also have the basic ones as well. But you don't want to buy these gray ones. You want to go for the gold ones. The gold ones are usually hard to get. It's not easy to get them. Now, I do want to explain as well as I'm showing a clip right now so you guys could get that back then, this event wasn't the way it is now. It used to be way different. There used to be 10 stages on normal and there used to be 10 stages on hard. Now they revamped it to where it's a little bit more different. It's easier to do, but I feel like we are kind of losing gems. I don't know. You guys can let me know in the comments if we are losing more gems or not. Because I'm just starting to do this event when it comes out. When I'm waking up as well. So let me show you guys. Now that you've seen the video, it is now go through easy, normal, a little bit of the story, hard, very hard, and ultra. Now, the ultra difficulty is not ready to be done yet. We have to wait until the 16th of February. I don't know if in Japan that's the 16th and then for us it's the 15th. We'll have to see. But yes, so there is... For global players, I recommend that you grind the um, normal one. Just to have it out the way. If you are a little bit more stronger though and you have been grinding this game very consistently, you can do the very hard one. But I doubt that anybody in global is able to do the 190,000 power yet. Unless you've been wasting money on those packs that are able to make your characters even stronger. There is no way in hell. Because this very hard mode is hard look at the power right here on the top right it is 190,000. there is no way a global player that just started this game either yesterday or today is able to do this now if you do have the brand new uraraka the brand new um ur or the support memory that has come out on the banner as well both of them the ur and the sr support memory you are able to get a bonus amount of medals when you do this event also if you do manage to get the free to play support memory as well which is right here you are also able to get a bonus from this as well as i will be showing in a second so if i plan to go into this stage on very hard and let's say i want to make a whole new team so i'll bring this midoriya 
and what do i want to change out no this is the team i use this is the team i used to beat it as you guys can see my power is very high 268,000. so i was able to smoke it no problem at all um i'll do it on this team i don't even know why this team is created so if we go all the way down here where is the support memory i feel like i'm going to miss it okay it is right here as you guys can see, it has that little icon on the top right. On global, it will translate to something else. But on the Japanese version, you can see on that little icon, that means that you will be getting a bonus on this brand new event. Now, you don't necessarily have to max it out. You could just have it on a character on the side. If you are confident that your team is able to beat it with just the three main characters. So, with that, that's basically it. Actually, before I do end the video, let me just max this out real quick just to um, get it done. Um, it doesn't matter which team I pick. I'll just pick the team right here. Just go right now. But with that, that is basically it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to like and comment if you want to. You don't have to, but it's always greatly appreciated. Also, subscribe. Now, another advice I want to give before the video ends. Do not waste all your energy like I just did. What you want to do, actually, is sit, put half your energy into the event. And then put half of the other energy into, the, um, into grinding on your characters. Because don't forget, you are starting the game. So you want to focus on making your characters even stronger. So... Please, focus on half of the event and half of making your character even stronger to the ability board. But with that, I'll see ya when I see ya. Peace.